What's going on guys? Real quick, I figured I'd show you how to replace your freezeless faucet outside um, if you don't have one of these and it freezes. Um, there's a good chance your uh, your faucet may freeze if there's water inside the pipe. This one's already taken out, that's why it's loose. <clears throat> uh, but I have one of those as you can see. But the other day I used my faucet outside and like an idiot, I left it hooked up uh, and didn't get all the water out of it, it froze. So I'm gonna replace it. So what you do, you take your big old pipe wrench right here, you're gonna put it around the faucet and you're gonna turn it. And what that's gonna do, it's gonna turn and turn and then you should be able to slide it out. If you have a house like mine, there's a good chance they might have bricked around it. I had to chip, I had to chip it out. I had to get, you can see those little drill holes. I got a, uh, I'll put it inside. Um, I've got a little concrete bit and I had to drill a couple holes and then chip it out and then I was able to pull it out. Maybe you can, maybe you cannot see right there. You can see where it, feed, where it uh, threads in there. So uh, when I turned it on, there was water coming out from the brick. So I immediately turned it off because that's obviously not right. Went inside the garage and there was water coming out from the wall. So I knew something, I knew something was busted. Did a little bit of research and it was the freezeless pipe. Um, so this is what it is. Mine's a four inch um, and that sucker busted almost halfway um, and you can, there was a lot of water in there so that's what's going to happen if it freezes it's going to pop right there but it's got like a little check valve in there one way um doesn't open unless you unless you turn on the faucet um uh, i'm not a not an expert on it i don't know exactly how that little fitting right there works but that's what uh lets you you know that's what allows this thing to be busted and not leak water all over the place in there well you know unless it's turned on so twist it loose and it should just pull right out went to the hardware store bought this one it was 40 bucks and a little bit of change like 40 it was 40 bucks so uh that's the same one i'm gonna put it on make sure you use some pipe tape put the pipe tape around there obviously you're gonna want to turn your water off uh you know at the meter mine's in the middle of the yard and uh you know so i've got it turned off so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna put a little bit of pipe tape on here real quick and uh, then we'll go from there. All right guys, real quick, whenever you're putting this pipe tape on here, this Teflon tape, um, make sure it goes on the right way. So what I like to do is I like to take it and I like to turn my fitting, put it on the fitting and then turn the fit fitting the same way I'm gonna be turning it to feed it in there um, just to make sure that I've got it going on the right way and uh, and that I'm gonna uh, not get it all you know gummed up and stuff inside there so that's that's how I like to do it um, you do it like that and you know it's gonna go on the right way every time so just a little tip right there there's probably plenty other tips but uh, so that's what I'm gonna do so there we go so let me get this thing threaded in there Got it on there, threaded it in, got it to where it was tight, and just took it right there. Um, you can see it dripping. I've turned it on already to make sure it works and it's not leaking inside, which it is not. Um, I saw a good tip making sure that it's actually uh, working correctly and not busted in there, not leaking. You just kind of barely turn it on. It's fine, barely turn it. There we go. Put your thumb over it and then eventually uh, no, I don't have it on enough put your thumb over it and then the pressure just shoots it out like that and so that's how you know that it's good if, you, if you've got a busted pipe or a leak in there it should force out that way uh, so there's that hopefully this helps super easy job as long as you can get it out of there like I said all you do is you take this uh, pipe wrench and just untwist it it should untwist straight from there that 
piece, that new piece comes exactly like this. You put it back in, thread it on, turn your water on and go. Pretty simple job. Hopefully this helps somebody.